in the program. Now we take you to KwaZulu Natal where the Mjalose family in Sweet Waters in Peter Maritzburg will be saying their final goodbye to six family members who died in the devastating floods in the province. Premier Sekhe Zigalala will also be attending the funeral to pay his respects. We cross live to SABC News reporter Mlonde Khadebe in Sweetwaters for this live report. It's great to have you Mlonde indeed. How is the Mlalose family faring in these utterly sad circumstances bearing six family members? Uh, thank you very much. Some, uh, it's still hard for the family of Mlalose because they're still also searching for other members that are still missing. Basically, they were flooded in uh, the area of Inanda in Deben, but the family home is here in Peter Marisbeck, Sweetwaters. Next to me are the family members. I'll just speak to uh, Togozani Mlalose, who will briefly tell us about uh, the family members. Togozani, sorry, uh, thank you very much for your time. Briefly about uh, the family members. We see that now they are, buried, they are being uh, taken here to Peter Marisbeck. Why and what does it mean to the family? Where were these people? These people come from uh, Inanda, Pola, Pola district to be exact. We are here in Peter Marisbeck because their father, their grandfather lives here. This is home to them. I'm from the maternal side. This is the paternal side. Yeah. So we, we men, we are, we are we are, we are happy to see the support of the people. At least they comfort us. Yeah, we are, we are, we are shredded, but because we are seeing uh, the whole of Mkungunlu who is here, at least we have that. Uh, yeah. If you can tell us, basically, we just need to know who are they to you as Mdalose, um, if maybe you can just take us back uh, to what happened during that time on the night of uh, 11th April? Uh, I'm, I'm the uncle. I'm, I'm, I'm the brother to the deceased lady who perished with her kids, her four kids and five grandchildren. Man, it's hard, man. It's been, it's been a hard three weeks, man. We're still missing four. But it's okay. It's hard, but since we see people like you here, at least that comfort gives us strength. It's hard. It's hard. Sia zuguti guse na bantu nchi ni sabafu nenda we niga kulgaz njengu ba ukazi guti amani ya malumu mdeni ni sabafu na mshambe logo gu niga lipi tembo manga be uhulmenes fundazwe no sonde lagnini? Hey, asubo wangu hulmenes fundazwe no sonde lagnini. Asubo wangu zamile prayambe ya wangu. Ya uu. Utumele kutumele ile kwa sechwa. Ya zinjenga manji ee mfitu. Sio bongo kulu kulu mabe chola gele. Ya, asna, asna, asna pati manza, asna niks. Sio bongo kulu 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 mabe chola gele. Ya, uwa manji itisbege laba bak chola gele. Sikubege ngempile mfitu. We'll keep on searching. We won't stop searching. No, seba wangu kulu wangu skasa. Thank you for it. There was uh, Togo Zani Mdalose, the uncle to uh, the family uh, of uh, Mdalose. Basically, we'll speak uh, to Linda. Linda, thank you very much for your time. Umu ngase mtambu jo shitaze lega fushane. Uwe naglo mdenu, ushobe nega njanapu. Ngibonge kakulu, tina sabaka kabashe. Njobe besege wakaza umfwe tu Togo Zani. Kuti abandwa na abaka kabashe. Usi suami lo, wa mtona kwa Mdalose. Kushuti saiti liga mama wake, nga lega Mdalose. Besa isa itilga baba linga na anga sekaya ugu ubabu wami opinde abe ubaba wake usisilindi e, olu lilege ese zula ganye nabantwa nabake e, ganye nabazugulu. So aba ulanje umuntu olu lile usiswami ganye ne, na, nabazugulu ugu abazugulu gmina ganye ne ingane zitimalu megmina. Mshambe, ngoba ni na nisem kumundov, ni stache ganja nile skamego, nukuti nasi zwa ganja nige skati mtoluti. Statu gaga kulu, sashoke gaga kulu, siya understand uguti ugu fakona, kutwa sasa nga lindele uguti kungenzega, angale ndelo gwenzege nga ayo, uguti kutishe nje guvalu nge sata, ngubu mkuluma upega inga nizga sisu sisube ne inga nizu seven. So, nge ntanta tizeni, wafona, ngali langale skamego, etela omunye, wamatotaka zaku, kutakanga bui 
ngasinga semsebenzi na kazami nda ukona yogutala lengoba isi mosezu la siko sike omunye wae varashile ge varashile umganu wakebese kutu mtu analo omunye omgano umatino o, o, o umfana ubegatela ekaya katabashe epita maritbeki bagwazo kutige basi ndi ganjalo la baba tatu bonke la baba ishumi ababega tebese njini they perish so njenga manje siya bonu kuti kusaka ala gya funu mtambe logo kushukutini nina ngoba njaba ni kubega na kufuna na babali abayana watula gali kutandu kuba nzima kakulu kuti na ngoba nati siya suga lai maritpe kisiye kona siyo legelela ukufuna e, siya bona ke siya legelelega na sasa iti nilga hulmeni no mpaka tuwa senanda sifisu gubonga kakulu e, batela yonki nto bahambe sihambe endi gubugega gu riski no masihamba la paya sipega kutwa abapela manja na soso nkisikati baya Puma, bazo slegele la njengo mdeni wakamza lose na katabashe Uguti sitole amalunga umdeni etu njoba sasbato lilege Aba istupa njoba kusele la baba ufo Esi inete mbalo uguti unkulu unkulu zo slegele la Sitine na bosbato lile ngoba sasbwa mugele Uguti isi mosese nzegili Esa sikfisa njoba uguti stoli tambulabo Besa silbega ngenjele shompegili Mkambe siyazi uguti skati sinze malesi Igupu mkambe unga tutuza le umdeni lesi skati Hey, kunzi magakulu kutuwa ge ogu stutuza na gakulu ukubona isa pote si ito la yogubantu basi South Africa singasanganisa bona abantu be indaba abalegele layo uguti kufunwe njoba kufunwa uhulumeni kanye no mparati genje wonke wase South Africa indela abasi kulegisa ngayo nukfiga tina bezo sbona besi tutuza ne mialezo esi ito layo iyona esi nige zitemba na nuguti sbona gala simili Sbona kulu baba nisikasa Gibonge wakulu there was Linda Tabashe, the family member of the six that uh, perished uh, during the floods in Inanda. Basically, he's telling us that uh, his sister phoned the other kids saying that they must not come back uh, to home because the rain, it was bad in that area. Also, the, the last born was visiting them here in Sweetwaters. So the three children are left behind and they are grateful that at least they still have the three. But they are still also searching for the other four that are still missing because at the house there were about uh, 10 uh, people that were at the house when uh, the floods uh, basically flattened their home in Inanda. Uh, back to you, studio for now. Mm, Londi, that's an indeed a very sad picture there as we're seeing some of the families, you know, taking stock on the aftermath of these devastating floods. Londi, I know there's also some uh, family members that are left behind now uh, that you just told us about. Perhaps maybe just tell us where they are being housed at the moment and uh, the search for the missing four as well. We've seen how aid workers have been faring as far as, you know, finding some missing people as well. What kind of help are they getting as far as that is concerned? concerned Mlundi. Uh, basically what happened in, in that area is that most of people who were basically victims of floods they are housed in nearby halls because they are also halls but in this family some members uh, they took them back uh, to Peter Marisbeck for the time being because some other the two young uh, basically children are not working so it was easy for them to be taken uh, back to Peter Marisbeck but the older the, the eldest the one that was working is also kept in a family uh, site here there in in Deben just to try and comfort them because they are saying that it's very hard for them even though when they go to that area to search it's not safe even uh, to go because you'd remember that most of bridges in Deben in those areas of Inanda uh, in those areas of Molweni bridges were washed away roads were washed away and the, uh, are not accessible even to rescue teams to go and assist them Mm. Indeed, Mlondi. And uh, we see as well, uh, Premier Zigalala is expected to also uh, address uh, the crowds there, people in attendance. Uh, what time is he expected to arrive and perhaps maybe what is he expected to touch on as he speak there at the funeral? Because I'm sure uh, the devastation that has been caused by the floods will also be, you know, part of his um, address there. Uh, 
the premier is already here as the, the funeral service is underway but the premier might uh, speak in the next a uh, few minutes because they are just uh, attending the sermon for now then the premier will address us and we also expecting the premier to give us an update in relation to the death toll and also to the number of people that are still missing in Wazul Natal. We understand that the search and rescue teams in Deben, they are busy trying to recover whatever they can in many rivers because you remember that in the other parts of Deben, also Ntege Umlazi, where the parts that were badly affected, Umlot was also badly affected in the northern part of Deben, as well as Inanda. So the, those, the search and rescue teams, they are all out and trying to communicate and work with the communities on the ground. Back to you in studio. Live from Peter Maritzburg, that's SABC News reporter. Thank you so much indeed for joining us there. Now, Minister